frenzied excitement, he eats up the ground. He paws fiercely, rejoicing in his strength, and charges into the fray, afraid of nothing. When the trumpet sounds. Our father's farm has been losing money for years. To run a horse breeding operation, you need a certain touch. You're a housewife. I feel like I could make something work. Miss, this is a gentleman's club, miss. I need a good trainer just to get things stabilized. You need a Lucian Lauren. He dresses like Superfly. He's trying to retire. I'm tired of babysitting half-ton animals who are stubborn as their owners are. Any other questions? How much did you spend on that hat? How would you like to see a horse being born? Have you ever seen that? What? The colts stand up that fast. Well, Mr. Lauren, what do you think? I think he eats too much. He lays against the back of that starting gate like he's in the Caribbean. Secretariat is not afraid, and neither am I. Horse racing is unforgiving for housewives. It's like every other multi-million dollar gamble we housewives make every day. <laughs> All right, then. Let's show them what you're made of. We're out of time. We need six million dollars. We just lost a race that we could not afford to lose. You're guaranteeing that this horse is going to win the Triple Crown. Three races, three states, in just five weeks. Hasn't been done in 25 years. You're that stubborn. I'm that right. She scares me. Good. Hey, there's Mom. Now that you've gotten their attention, every owner, every trainer, every jockey out there is going to be trying to bring us down. This is about life being ahead of you, and you run at it. You're about to see something that you ain't never seen before.